Hi, once again, welcome to Pinoy's Ways Abroad. Here's another travel series waiting for you. Enjoy! This time, I will be showing you the New Zealand award-winning Echo Attraction. This was just 5 minutes from the top of the cable car by Free Shuttle. This is the continuation of my previous video, the cable car and the botanic gardens. Just to let you know, we've been traveling by plane since September 2020 here in New Zealand because we are COVID free in the community. If you're new to my channel, please check out the travel series of Christchurch, Rotorua, and this time it's Wellington. I'll be touring you around Zealandia and this is their entrance. Zealandia is at 225 hectares of the Eco Sanctuary. So that's the reason why the ticket is good for two days. As you can see, there are some rules and regulations here that you must follow. Zealandia is an eco sanctuary located in central Wellington. Yes, you heard it right. Zealandia is near the CBD of central Wellington. Wellington is the capital of New Zealand. Yes, and if you're only here, you will be amazed that this forest is just a few minutes away from the city. It is actually similar to Zurich in Switzerland. The only difference is uh, Zurich is like a combination of Wellington and Auckland in one. There you go! Napakaganda po ng tanawin, di ba po? This is an electronic boat. You can ride this by just giving a gold coin donation. The gold coin here is the $1 and $2 coins. It's so affordable considering that you will enjoy riding this boat and enjoy the nature. Plus, they will give you some insights about this Echo Sanctuary. Don't underestimate this beauty. This water is 20 meter deep. But don't worry, you are very safe in this electric powered boat. So, let's get started. Ala Jurassic Park po ang itsura niya, di ba po? Don't worry, you will be pleased to know there are no dinosaurs here as well as other wild animals like snakes, crocodiles, or whatsoever. Zealandia is a predator-proof eco-sanctuary. It's home to some of the world's most extraordinary animals. Bird lovers would love this area. There are some 36 species of shag worldwide. 12 of these are found in New Zealand, of which 8 are endemic. Endemic means found nowhere else. They are often seen sitting on a perch with their wings spread out, dripping their feathers because it's not waterproof making it easier for them to dive and stay underwater for approximately 20 to 30 seconds per dive. Aren't they incredible? Now here we landed perhaps just a kilometer away from the main entrance.
It's been a long time since I've seen a dragonfly. Would you believe there is also a blue dragonfly? Ang bilis po kasi nilang lumipad kaya hindi po ako nakapag-picture agad. Here we enter the Eden. Para po siyang Garden of Eden. Now let's start to walk. As you can see, it's very dense, these bushes. Don't worry, there is no snakes in New Zealand. There's no wild animals that will eat you alive. The only predators or pests that you can uh, consider here are the stoats, rats, squirrels, and even the possum. If you have seen my previous video, you have seen this bird. Only if nakaabot po kayo doon sa dulo. That's the reason why I always say try to watch in full. So you will know more information even at the very end of my video. Na-entertain na kayo, na-educate pa. Diba mas maganda po yung ganon? And this is where we ate our lunch. O diba bongga? Here's another tip. Zealandia is also good for serious hikers. There are a lot of trails that you can go to. So, okay po talaga siya sa mga hikers. It's also good for the whole family. Kahit nga po, baby, na naka-stroller. Pwede naman po dito. Pwede rin naman kayong bumalik agad because the tickets are good for two days. So this is the kaka, the largest parrot in North Island, New Zealand. And we are lucky to see up close this kaka bird. They are smart birds and they are tamed here in Zealandia. Sanay na po kasi sila sa mga taong bumibisita dito araw-araw. Now, I'll show you some other types of birds.
ayan, nagsabong na silang dalawa. Nakakatuwa po silang tignan, di ba po? You learn something by just watching them. Ang kulit po kasi ni Parakit, laging inaagawan ng pagkain si Hihi. Ayan, nagsawa na po siya sa kakukulit. Nagsawa din siya sa puno, kaya ayan, maglakad-lakad muna. Nang mabanat-banat ang paa, total wala naman po kasing predator dito. Now, here we go to another type of bird, saddleback. Can you see it? There's a red line on its neck. And that's where they got its name because there's a red saddle that looks like a saddle on its back. Now, I'll introduce you to our special insect called Weta. Yes, it is a giant insect, but it's harmless. So, when you come here in New Zealand and you see them, don't ever kill them. It's prohibited and they are protected. Yes, and don't be surprised, we talk to the animals. I was wondering why they keep on coming to us. Every time we move, they also come. So, there is a reason. Yan po ang ebidensya. Ginawa kaming payong sa amin pasumilong. Anyway, don't worry if your bladder is full. Meron pong toilet dito. Malinis po siya at kompleto. So when you get the chance to come here in New Zealand and here in the capital, which is the Wellington, don't forget to book to go here in Zealandia. Our last glimpse of the place. Malaki po talaga siya, malawak, so hindi po talaga pwede ng isang araw lang. Until next time, I hope you are enjoying this and learning from it as well. At sa lahat po ng mga umabot dito sa dulo, maraming maraming salamat po. I do appreciate your likes and your comments. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell button.